place a clip in a timeline that you want to play inside of your text. Then make sure you have the properties panel open. And if you don't see it, click on the window tab and go to properties. Then use the type tool to create your text. You can do this by going to the toolbar to activate it or press the T key to use this tool. Once the type tool is active, Go to the program monitor and click on any portion within this panel to create your text. Then type out your text. After you finish typing out your text, double click within the text box to highlight all of your text. Then go to the properties panel and then go to the text section and you can change the font to your choosing. I'm currently using Montserrat bold. Then go to the align and transform section and go to scale and hover over the blue number value and click and drag it to the right to increase the size of your text. You want to make sure your text takes up a good portion of the frame and then go back to the align and transform section and click on the align center horizontally icon and then select the align center vertically icon to center your text. Hover over the corners of your text layer in a timeline and click and drag it to the right to extend it and make sure it covers your entire video. Then press shift seven to open the effects panel and in the search bar, type in track mat and select the track mat key effect and drag and drop it to the video clip in the timeline that you want inside of your text. Then press shift five to open the effect controls window and in the effect controls window, go to the track mat key section and go to mat and change it from none to the video track that has your text. I have my text on video track two, so I'm going to change it from none to video track two. And this is how you add video inside of text in Premiere Pro. Like and subscribe for more Premiere Pro tutorials, and I'll see you on the next one.